Rebecca's story is being shared thousands of times on our social media pages, and it sparked a conversation between moms on opposite sides of the world who know the Kalani family's devastation all too well. Tonight, they speak with 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ali Tui. My heart sank. Akia Hollingsworth of Buffalo. It brought up all the memories. Doesn't know Luca Kalani's family, but she says she does know what they're going through. It's hard. It brings back all the memories of what I went through. Akia's only child, Maya, died in 2009 from complications of the flu and MRSA. Maya was only nine years old. I miss Maya. I wish she was here every day. Akia posted her personal experience to our 7 Eyewitness News Facebook page and half a world away. A mom in Australia could relate. Angela McDermott writing, so sorry, we lost our beautiful Georgie in 2011, three months after her seventh birthday to the flu. You're happy you're not alone, but it's a club you don't want somebody else to join either. And they understand what you're speaking of, whereas a lay person wouldn't. Akia says she only recently started going to therapy to cope with her loss. None of us are promised tomorrow. Kalani's death now hitting close to home. I'm wrapping my head around it again because it's just not fair. It's not fair to lose your child to something that that most of us recover from. So my condolences out to his parents and um, I'm crying now, but you do get you learn to cope. A friend of Luca's family has organized a porch light vigil. They're asking you to light up the night by turning your porch light orange in memory of Luca. The goal is to bring the family some comfort, Ashley and Jeff, during this difficult time. Just an absolutely heartbreaking story, one that really touches all of us for sure. It's heartbreaking, it's frustrating, it's maddening, it wants, makes me want to cry right here. No. It's so sad. The main point though from Ashley Luca's mother here is that she wants him remembered for how he lived and not how he died guys. Okay. All right, Allie, thank you very much. And here is yet